New faces will roam the halls as the school year starts this morning in Clay County. Sheriff's Office is handling security and safety once again. News for Texas reporter Brianna Andrews joins us live. And Brianna, this transition happened over the summer. Yeah, this went into effect on July 1st after the school board decided to disband the district police. District police served Clay County schools for four years. It was created in response to the Marjorie Stoneman Douglas shooting. The agency received funding through an increasing an increase rather in property taxes. In 2023, the district began negotiations with the Clay County Sheriff's Office to replace district police and got approved. Board members waited until July 1st to move forward with the transition just one day after the district police department's contract ended. Just district officers were transitioned to the, the sheriff's office. Now for deputies new to working in schools, Clay County Sheriff Michelle Cook told News for Jax they've been preparing for the change in pace. It's going to be important that our SROs understand their students and understand the needs of their students and Yes, we are there in case of the worst case scenario, but it is also important that our deputies take every opportunity to learn the kids, earn their trust and build relationships, long lasting relationships that, you know, will last a lifetime for, for everybody. And just for perspective, Clay County will open its doors to 43 schools, including 40,000 students and 5,000 employees. But the sheriff says they're ready. Reporting live, Brianna Andrews, Channel 4, the local station.